Thank you, Sam S. Williamson, for the uh, for your video called um, "From an Insider" or something. Just recently, where you stated an MI5 guy had told you that for every truth there is a lie. And thank you to Sarah Pato. Sorry, if I said that wrong. Who does videos speaking prophetic messages? For your last message about saying that we should only listen to God and not listen to any of these man made prophecies as they won't be right and will only be disappointed. Um, put them both together and I believe I have a theory on what's going on. And you could say God's talk is volcanoes going off, natural events. So for every one of those that are happening and there is a lot. The the bad guys, the beast, come come up with something to take our attention off that. Maybe a riot, a war. So they don't want us to be prepared for what's coming, what's been prophesied. They're getting ready to do some tricks of their own. Apparently with these all these chemtrails for whatever else they do and the beast just doesn't really care, does he? He doesn't care if it poisons us poisons the land but apparently they can make it's going to enable them to make some pretty cool sights in the sky so yes you're going to have to be careful when looking at the sky is this a natural event or is this is this some bullshit Oh, there's a lot of bullshit. And I'm not bullshitting, I've been wrong plenty of times. But it was only my true thoughts. And that's what I'll always give. Okay, so the moral of this one is um, keep our eyes on the earthquakes and volcanoes and weather events and meteors and look out for Nibiru and its circling planets and um, sort of stay away from the coast and Uh, I think um, it's easy to <laughs> wonder if I'm going mad, but I'm not. I'm not going mad. You know, you just have to apply logic to things. The weather events we've been having over the last few years and the increase in volcanoes, the earth wobbling fast, the magnetics that is going on, you know, if people had their fucking heads screwed on, everyone would be shouting, what is going on? And they're not telling us, that's the main reason most people don't know because they only have one source of information 
in the media. There are lots more people on YouTube, which is good. So keep spreading the word, you know, about watching alternate. But you know, it's such a minefield now. You've almost got to be an expert to watch YouTube. You know, if someone new comes into YouTube, it's going to be like, oh, what? You know, they're not going to know where to go. It's going to take them at least a few months to sort of get the gist of things. So, we need a helping hand to wake more people up. Because I don't think there's much time left. We, we are on the brink. And, um, what to say? It's, it's futile really, but probably this is my ego making me make this. And I kind of convinced myself it's not that I think we had some sort of chance of warning someone. So if you are sitting there thinking, well, warn me of what, then in a nutshell, every 3,600 years, there's this mini solar system which is in a binary, we've got a binary solar system, if you like, with a big, big brother, and the little brother is, has been in our solar system for a few years and it's been carefully covered up and it's it is what is causing so many odd events it seems against my conclusion that it's not all due to cars and factories and things like that it's because, you know, how would that affect the magnetics of the Earth and its wobble, the gravitational effects, the increased earthquakes and volcanoes? It wouldn't. And then you've got this whole theory that the Earth is expanding. And for that to happen, it would have to have some sort of increase in mass and heat on a periodic... Um, Scale, on a, on a periodic, can't get my words out. Oh, we're all getting thick as well because these chemtrails and tired. And, oh, it's the, oh, the devil has shown his head. He's out there. They just don't care about us. The the drugs, they're not meant to kill us. They're just meant to keep us stupid. And I was thinking today as well, in England it seems at the moment, if, you know, the, the government are handing out money here, there and everywhere for benefits and stuff. I think it's so important, I think London is so important to keep going. And at this sort of late stage, there's nothing going on in the economy, nothing going on whatsoever that we're gearing up to something is very close and I am waffling now so I'm gonna shut up and um, leave you with this just God talking is the weather the volcanoes that's the true bits all the other stuff is a lie I don't know what they're up to don't care don't care. God is coming. Or if God is probably the wrong word. A more advanced species that we once thought was God. But gave us good teachings. They taught us good ways. And um, Jesus may well have been, you know, one of those species who kind of gave up his life sacrifice um, 
you know, but I put Jesus on the same level as Muhammad, apostles, prophets, not, not, you know, more God than I am, or than you are. We're all, all have souls, who are all infinite beings, just about knowing that and teaching your children that. Imagine if we all did that. Yeah. It would be good. So, um, just want to say fuck you to the devil. And if YouTube, you know, if this video is right and you don't promote it at all, so like my last one, I may have touched on the truth. And by the way, if I'm right about this, then somehow they managed to cover Alex Jones. I just had, a, I just had a, a really strange thought. If they like <laughs> implanted something in his brain, because Alex Jones used to be called Bill Hicks, and you look up Bill Hicks, he's cool dude who's saying all the same stuff then. So you know, I really like Alex Jones. And no, he should expose the Bilderberg group. Why did I say if this is true? Yes, because, well, he doesn't talk about Nibiru at all. He doesn't talk about weird weather. He only goes on about those things, which, you know, obviously I'm probably wrong. Um, <laughs> so, but it's always good to have another viewpoint, isn't it? You know, weigh them up. Anyway. I uh, don't know if I make another one. If I'm right. So I'm bound to be wrong. Anyway, waffled on long enough. Thanks if anyone watched it. Bye.